All right, Eagle fans, we're joined here by the UWL baseball seniors, Caleb Maddell, Tim Erlab, and Jack Moran. Uh, after the Eagles found out today that they were one of 19 teams to get an at-large bid to the NCAA tournament, uh, which starts this weekend with the regional, as the Eagles will be hosting uh, the regional at Copeland Park. First of all, Caleb, let's just talk a little bit about, like, what does it mean to you guys as a senior uh, to, to make the national tournament? Yeah, it's uh, pretty exciting, making it last year and now this year as well. It's um, best part of the year, I'd say. So pretty fired up, ready to go. Perfect. And and Tim, uh, how do you think you guys are playing coming in? Obviously, you made a little bit of run at the conference tournament, lost in the conference championship to UW Whitewater. Uh, you were the two seed going in the tournament, but that's obviously behind you guys now. It's a new season for you guys. Just talk a little bit about how you guys are your plan. Yeah, I think uh, you know there's been some ups and downs throughout the season, but the ultimate goal of this team is to be playing our best ball at, at this point of the year. I think. We showed flashes of that, that uh, second day and Friday. We played two really good baseball games. Obviously came up a little bit short on Saturday in the championship, but I think it just betters us for this weekend and moving forward. And I, I like where we're at playing ball now. And Jack, let's talk last year's team. I, I get that was in the past, but last year's team made a run to the College World Series. Uh, got to play, or host a regional last year, host a super regional and make that run. A lot of guys back from that roster. Talk a little bit about what that experience may be, how that experience plays into this year. Yeah, I mean, it definitely helps. I think that the biggest thing we learned last year is that we belong at the top of those teams. And although, although it didn't go as well as we wanted it to last year, we definitely learned from it, building off of that. And, you know, my five years here, last year was the only year that we were actually in a tournament out of all those. So just finally being able to get some experience there is really helpful and great role. Awesome. And maybe maybe one of you can just touch on what does it mean? Obviously, like I said, you're playing at Copeland Park this weekend, playing at home. Uh, what does that mean to you guys to play at Copeland? I mean, it helps a lot. Sleep in our own beds and get used to that. But um, overall, we're just we're used to the stadium. It plays a little bit different than most because how short it is, the turf, and, and everything like that. So it definitely helps us. But it's where we're comfortable and we're really excited to be there. And maybe Caleb, being a local guy, I mean, what does that mean? Playing old, stay home again, play one more time in front of the local fans. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, I've been able to do my whole career, but yeah, you get your home fans coming in, so a little different. You don't have to travel and. And jumping in, I don't know, for us, it's going to be what we know is the last time we get to play there. So a little extra special for us three, knowing that this weekend could be the last time that we ever ever get to play a game there. So really just taking advantage of that opportunity and with the group we have and, and enjoy that last moment. Awesome, Eagle fans. Just a reminder, the Eagles will play 11 o'clock on Friday against Bethel. following game will be Benedictine versus Coe at 2.30. So come on out Friday at Copeland. We'll be there all weekend, and hopefully the Eagles will be there all weekend as well. Con uh, congrats on, the, on, the, on making it, and, and good luck. Yeah.